En esta ocasión escucharemos el relato de una noticia sobre el bombardeo en el aeropuerto de Estambul en Turquía. The Istanbul Bombing Hay que recordar que cuando se relata noticias, estas por lo general están expresadas en un inglés avanzado. Well, good morning, George. While there still has been no claim of responsibility. Well, good morning, George. While there still has been no claim of responsibility. U.S. officials this morning say the attackers left behind significant clues about who they were. U.S. officials this morning say the attackers left behind significant clues about who they were. Some of the most important clues are being discovered on that airport surveillance tape. Some of the most important clues are being discovered on that airport surveillance tape. Counterterrorist and officials spotted the apparent confident demeanor of the suicide attackers. Counterterrorist and officials spotted the apparent confident demeanor of the suicide attackers. Each moving to a different position. Each moving to a different position. One wearing a winter coat on an 84 degree day to hide his suicide bomb. One wearing a winter coat on an 84 degree day to hide his suicide bomb. The fact that the attackers had a very specific plan, that they knew the places that they wanted to be. The fact that the attackers had a very specific plan, that they knew the places that they wanted to be, that they appeared to act on a coordinated fashion, that they appeared to act on a coordinated fashion. All those are indications that this was a well-planned and well-orchestrated attack. All those are indications that this was a well-planned and well-orchestrated attack. The hallmarks of ISIS amid what officials call its increasing tempo of attacks on western targets. The hallmarks of ISIS, amid what officials call its increasing tempo of attacks on western targets. Right now I'm still very concerned that the the ISIL generated engine of right now I'm still very concerned that the the ISIL generated engine of of foreign terrorism outside of Syria and Iraq, of foreign terrorism outside of Syria and Iraq, still has a lot of momentum that we cannot rest at all. Still has a lot of momentum that we cannot rest at all. We have to increase our efforts. We have to increase our efforts. And U.S. officials hope the tragedy at the airport will lead Turkey to increase its efforts. And U.S. officials hope the tragedy at the airport will lead Turkey to increase its efforts. The country's border with Syria has been the principal gateway for recruits to travel in and out of ISIS training camps. The country's border with Syria has been the principal gateway for recruits to travel in and out of ISIS training camps. In 2014, Vice President Biden told an audience in Harvard that Turks knew their border had become far too porous. In 2014, Vice President Biden told an audience in Harvard that Turks knew their border had become far too porous. President Erdogan told me as an old friend, said, you were right, we let too many people through. President Erdogan told me as an old friend, said, you were right, we let too many people through. Now they're trying to seal their border. Now they're trying to seal their border. So far, at least 6,000 Europeans and others have crossed the Turkish border into Syria. Many did join ISIS. So far, at least 6,000 Europeans and others have crossed the Turkish border into Syria. Many did join ISIS. 
Ahora escuchemos la noticia. Well, good morning, George. While there still has been no claim of responsibility, U.S. officials this morning say the attackers left behind significant clues about who they were. Some of the most important clues are being discovered on that airport surveillance tape. Counterterrorism officials spotted the apparent confident demeanor of the suicide attackers, each moving to a different position, one wearing a winter coat on an 84-degree day to hide his suicide bomb. The fact that the attackers had a very specific plan, that they knew the places that they wanted to be, that they appeared to act in a coordinated fashion, all of those are indications that this was a well-planned and well-orchestrated attack the hallmarks of ISIS, amid what officials call its increasing tempo of attacks on Western targets. Right now, I am still very concerned that the, the ISIL-generated engine of, of foreign terrorism outside of Syria and Iraq still has a lot of momentum that we cannot rest at all. We have to increase our efforts. And U.S. officials hope the tragedy at the airport will lead Turkey to increase its efforts. The country's border with Syria has been the principal gateway for recruits to travel in and out of ISIS training camps. In 2014, Vice President Biden told an audience at Harvard the Turks knew their border had become far too porous. President Erdogan told me, he's an old friend, said, you were right, we let too many people through. Now they're trying to seal their border. So far, at least 6,000 Europeans and others have crossed the Turkish border into Syria, many to join ISIS.